Hello, legends, heroes, and poopy heads. Welcome to the Omni Flash channel, where Omni Flash will take gaming to the next level. Welcome back. My name is Omni Flash, and I am your guide to Diablo Immortal. Today, we're diving into the world of Diablo Immortal to unleash the ultimate barbarian build that will leave your enemies trembling in fear. Whether you're a seasoned warrior or a new player just starting out, this guide will equip you with everything you need to know to become the strongest barbarian in all of Sanctuary. So grab your weapons, sharpen your skills, and let's get going. This is the best barbarian build. This is not a lie. This is a build that I created after trying out maybe like 20 different builds. This is the ultimate build for challenge rifts that I get, get the highest scores with this in challenge rifts, making you an unstoppable force in tower, allowing you to just decimate and just destroy enemies in tower. Also, this is an excellent build for endless defense. I use this endless defense and it helps my survivability immensely. I love this build. A lot of barbarians still use whirlwind, which is very little damage, and you are stuck waiting on your stamina to regen. This instead uses ground stomp and the dauntless temper pants. The dauntless temper pants allow you to stomp the ground endlessly. There will not be any time to recharge. You will be stomping and crushing your enemies, knocking them back, making them not able to target or attack you with these pants. The Dauntless Temper Pants are insane. In order to make this ground stop even more unstoppable, you will be using the Weighted Brow Hat. The Weighted Brow Hat increases the range of your ground stop by 30%. Okay, so this makes you even more unstoppable your your ancient your will the ancients will be stopping the ground 30 percent larger radius anything that gets closer to you will be ground stopped and that knocks them back so it's very similar to the crusader horse that knocks enemies back however the horse only lasts a few seconds this ground stop is never ending you just keep stomping the ground there is no cooldown for this skill which makes this so insane you just run straight through if you're standing by a group of mobs they are constantly being knocked back they cannot attack next will be hell's legacy hell's legacy does an insane amount of damage whenever you use sprint which will be also up 100 percent of the time so it's sort of like the combination of having the knockback horse plus the fire horse for a crusader. You have both horses and it is on 100% of the time, making you able to just run straight through the enemy. You can actually just stand on the enemies. They will be burning, getting knocked back, and being stomped on all at the same time. For your main hand, you will want to be using Riddle Rue. The legendary Riddle Rue will allow your frenzy main attack, your frenzy normal attack, will be 50% faster whenever you crit. Okay, so this will be an incredible damage boost, allowing you to just smack, 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 and destroy those bosses plus those yellow elite mobs, the blue elite mobs. All right, let's talk about one skill that is interchangeable. Right here, I am interchanging Demoralize and changing it to Undying Rage. All right, so sometimes you'll want Undying Rage when you're attacking epic monsters such as the boss in Challenge Rift, which can kill you. Most of the time, uh, monsters cannot kill you, okay? You just go up to them and they are constantly knocked back. However, the Challenge Rift boss does not get knocked back. However, uh, the Challenge Rift mob summons, they do get knocked back. So what I would do, I recommend once you get to uh, a big boss that cannot be knocked back, change out Demoralize for Undying Rage. And this will allow you to live through uh, the boss's super attacks. Uh, Demoralize is also an incredible skill that I highly recommend uh, 
especially if you have a chip of stone flesh. So when I'm clearing just regular mobs, I always have Demoralize on. Demoralize is like a six second taunt, which will also proc chip of stone flesh on them, making all damage that you deal to them enhanced and will also explode. It is so insane. Your offhand will be Sundering Legacy. Sundering Legacy is your offhand. This will allow a Wrath of Berserker to be just uh, fire. You'll be just in a fireball all the time, non-stop fireball burning your enemies. All right, so for set items, I am using Atrophied. Atrophied is pretty good. You will actually set down poison. If you have a six set of Atrophied, you will poison the ground and slow your enemies every 30 seconds. However, even better, even better for this build would be like Detested. Detested will, every time you use a control skill such as Demoralize, if you control your enemies, that will set down a blob that also does damage and increases the damage dealt to anything inside that circle by 12% when at, uh, at a 6 set. Alright, so I don't have a 6 set on right now. In Challenge Roast, you want to have gear that is the highest combat rating. However, in other content, you can put on your sets. So a 6 set detested would be superb. For set items, you must have at least a 2 set of Vithus. At least a 2 set of Vithus will allow all of your skills to last the whole duration. So. You will have 100% uptime on sp on Sprint, 100% uptime on Wrath of Berserker, 100% uptime on Ground Stop. Your skills will never end. Also, with that bit news, your Undying Rage will last longer, making, your s making you invincible 30% longer. Now, you don't have any dashes in this build, so you will want to use Banquet of Eyes. Banquet of Eyes, a four set of Banquet of Eyes, uh, or uh, a two set of Banquet of Eyes and four, four Vithus. Any combination, four Vithus, two Banquet of Eyes, or four Banquet of Eyes, two Vithus will be ideal. However, I am in a challenge rift and you want the highest CR possible. Uh, even in, in challenge rifts, even if it drops your CR maybe like 20, 30 CR, you still want a two set of Vithus to make this build work. In everything else, uh, you, you can use slightly less CR and, and just make full sets. You want a four piece van uh, banquet and two piece Vithus is probably what I think will be best to increase your damage and give you the most uptime on all of your skills. If you have friends that are barbarians, show them this video. They will love you for it. Thanks for watching, and I'll see you guys in the next video. Don't forget to like and subscribe.